YouTube, this is Felicia with Bible Scraps, and I'm going to show you how you can make these super cute, fun, easy, embellished clothespins. Now, it's so easy, a tutorial is not really needed, but I'm going to do a quick one anyway. And as you all know, clothespins are hot. They're everywhere. You could find these at Michael's in their $1.50 bin. Target dollar spot, any and every craft store, they're everywhere. But how cute and fun to create your own. Now, in addition to these clothespins, I'm going to show you another type that I made, and I've never seen that type before. And so that's going to be really fun. But to get started, you only need a few supplies. Starting off, with your clothespins. Now these are full size clothespins. I picked these up at Michael's last year when they were on clearance. They're by Recollections, but they have this same set available this year. The Valentine colors are white, red, and pink. Now I've seen crafters use their red rubber stamps and their clear stamps. I'm gonna use my self inking stamps. I have not used these in a while. And I picked these up at Costco a long time ago, back when they used to always carry scrapbooking products. It's by a company called Message Store. I don't know if they're still in business. I've not seen anything from them in a long time. Now these cute hearts, they might look familiar to some of you because I picked these up at Target in their dollar spot. I think these are my favorite dollar spot find from Target this Valentine season. So really cool. And you get 25 in a pack for a dollar. Now, I'm also going to use my heat gun. Depending on what type of ink you use, if you use stays on, you don't necessarily need to use the heat gun. But if you use a self inking stamp or dye or pigment inks, you could let it sit or speed up the drying process by using a heat gun. So it's really simple. To do this, I'm going to start off with my full size clothespin. You want to pay attention to your orientation. When I did these the first time, I had my um, orientation the wrong way, and so I had to redo it. Now, I'm going to take one of my stamps. This one says Love. This is a stamp that has a wide stamping area, and I'm at an awkward angle. But my goal is to stamp right in the center. So let's see if I could do that. Nope. It's crooked. But you know what? It's handmade. <laughs> and when you make handmade items, it don't have to be perfect. So I'm going to use my heat gun to dry this. Or better yet, I'm not because it's really noisy. <laughs> so, um... Anyway, that's how you do that. And I didn't mention that I'm using my, oops, I didn't even plug up my, my hot glue gun. So, all right, I'm going to skip that step. But anyway, you would apply your hot glue here or you would apply a pop dot. And just place your heart there. Now, you could use capuchons or buttons, anything you like, but that is super Cute. I love it. Okay, so let me show you the other embellished clothespin I made. One in which I've never seen quite like this. Look at that. I use the word beads. I know they're popular right now and I just love it. It says love, live, and dance. And I used my hot glue to um, adhere that down. And check out this one. I heart you, love it. And then this one here says sweetheart, and I have my orientation going the wrong way, but I guess it could go that way. And here I used a capuchon that I made from a button, and I could have added the my word beat there. Now these might look a little funky, and that's because I made these myself. <laughs> but super cute. And then check out this one crazy in love my love bead fail i have to find that and then i will adhere that one there but super cute i love these just another way to use these word beads 
that you could pick up at Michael's and I'm sure other places have them as, as well. Now, I like using the word beats because you can create any phrase that you like. So how fun to come up with different phrases and sayings to add to your embellished clothespins. Well, I thank you guys for watching. I hope you find this video inspiring. If you like it, give it a thumbs up and I will see you guys shortly. Blessings.